Hey guys, it's Silver Snorlax, and I am back with PSA Returns Round 27 Part 2. Uh, just three more users to go through, uh, only a handful of cards, so this video will be fairly quick, uh, but still plenty of good stuff to look through. So, let's go ahead and jump straight in. We'll start with a small pile on, on the uh, left-hand side here. These cards are from Mr. Do It All Day, who has submitted with me a couple times before. So, we'll take a look at his. Uh, he, first off, we have a uh, Charizard Hall of the CD promo, which are actually very uh, popular promos. I do some quite a bit. This one only came back as a 6. Uh, took a look at it, couldn't quite figure it out. I think there is a hairline crease up at the very top. I can't even make it out. You can't make it out on camera. I could barely make it out in person, uh, but I believe that's why we're looking at a 6. Uh, a little bit of wear on the uh, front as well. Some edges, corners are a little... Um, Eh, but not to the point where it's going to knock it down to a 5 by any means. Hollow foil I thought, looked um, pretty pretty immaculate. Um, but unfortunately, that little crease is always going to get you. PSA tends to catch it quite a bit. Uh, moving on, we have Plasma Storm Charizard. Always a favorite. This one came back uh, uh, as a PSA 9. A Mew EX Full Art from Dragons Exalted. This one came back as a Mint 9. So good stuff from him. Next up, we'll look at a guy who was sent with me many, many times. This is uh, Gold Star. I'll drop that card first. So Gold Star sent with me several times. I'm sure he's going to be excited to be getting these cards back. It has, in fact, been a while since he's seen them last. Uh, Charizard Hollow from Exped Expedition. Two of those, both of which are Mint 9. A uh, Legendary Collection Charizard. Came back as a near Mint 8. Megalade EX from Roaring Skies came back as a gem mint 10. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous card. Mega Quasa EX also coming back as a gem mint 10 for him. A couple of those, so we have two. I uh, love this artwork on, on the uh, Thunderous EX here. Check that out. It looks incredibly powerful. Came back as a mint 9. And final one, Emerald Break Mega Rayquaza EX came back as a uh, Gem Mint 10 form as well. So very, very nice. Goes off to the side form. Uh, last submission we have here is from uh, We1456 or Wilson W um, on Facebook. I sent a couple of cards. Uh, last one's a goodie, so um, can't wait to show you these. Uh, Mega Tokyo Pikachu. First one's a goodie, too, for that matter. Uh, Mega Tokyo Pikachu, that's a very cute card. Uh, that's the one I know um, is requested to be done quite a bit. Um, Dark Blastoise Hollow, uh, the Japanese variant. Uh, only came back as near mint 8. I'm not entirely sure as far as to why. Uh, looked it over. It's kind of your standard stuff, not sure as far as to why the near mint grade was achieved. Uh, but uh, he did send a Dark War Turtle, the English variant, and that came back as a gem mint 10 form, as well as a Squirtle. Also, the English version uh, came back as a gem mint 10 as well. So, trying to build the trio, you're pretty close there. Mega Charizard EX came back as near mint 8.5. Don't see too many of the Y versions. Happy to see that one. Uh, Cor Coral Mew, one that I see. Uh, fairly frequently, this come back as a near mint 8, which is a justified grade, I thought. There is some uh, wear on the corners and edges there. Center, I didn't think, was um, was all there either. But, um, to be fair, these, these cards typically are printed um, with centering that's uh, in pretty decent shape. So, not, not too surprised by that grade. Uh, Mew Gold Star here, also near mint 8. Centering definitely your culprit here, I'll even show you. There's your right border, and take a look at that left border. You can see the um, actually rather severe difference between the two. So, uh, centering definitely your culprit on the uh, Dragon Frontiers Gold Star Mew. And this one I thought was really cool. Um, this is a Spring Battle Carnival Palace Belt, and it looks just like a trophy card. It's listed as promo. Uh, I'm actually not sure as far as to the background of this particular card, uh, but it did receive a Gem Mint 10, and fantastic artwork. Uh, plenty of sheen and sparkle of that little sparkle and sh um, shine that kind of encompasses the entire card. So that one's very cool and something new I haven't seen on the channel before. So I really rather enjoyed that one. All right, guys, like I stated, very quick round, very small. Um, I, actually, I'm looking at my uh, timer on my camera here and saying it's under five minutes. So 
Uh, very fast round. Uh, thanks to everybody who submitted in the June round. I know you guys had to wait uh, quite a while. Unfortunately, that's what happens with smaller rounds. However, we seem to have uh, fixed that problem on this channel. We'll see some bigger ones coming up in the future here, definitely. Uh, so, if you guys at home watching want to get in on the action, the in the description below I do have information regarding my own grading service and how you guys can submit. Uh, feel free to click that link. Always feel free to get in contact with me either through the comment section here, through PM, Facebook, Skype. I have multiple contact methods. Feel free to message me at any time. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. So, thanks again, June Submission guys. Really appreciate it. Thanks for being patient. And uh, as for the rest of you, we'll have more PSA returns coming up soon.